First, remove the LFD from its bag and spread it out on the ground. Next, assemble the poles, making sure the ends of the pole sections don't snap together, as this can cause damage to the poles. The LFD has five long poles and five short poles. Open all the doors and windows so you can avoid stepping on the tent when you set it up. Locate the very top panel of the tent. It's a pentagonal panel with a sling fin logo, but no letters. Insert the five long poles along the edges of this pentagon. Once all five long poles are in position, the tent will look like this. Following the seams in line with the edges of the pentagon, clip the first three cobra clips along the seam on every pole. Leave the last clip unclipped for now. At pole intersections, be sure to attach the cobra clip around the wider angle, not the sharper angle. Make sure the poles follow the seams on the tent body as shown. Then, ask your tallest friend to lift up the center of the tent from the inside. Have them hold the tent above their head. Sometimes it helps to give the tent a shake to unbunch the fabric. While the tent is being held up from the inside, put all the pole ends into the grommets marked L for long. Move quickly so the poles are all inserted before your friend's arms get tired. Once the poles are grommeted, clip the bottom cobra clips around the poles. Then, following the seams along the sides of the tent, insert the short poles through the cobra clips. Make sure the cobra clips at the pole intersections are oriented correctly. It helps to have one person feed the pole through while the other guides the pole through the clips. Grommet the tips of the short poles in the grommet tabs labeled S. Good. Make sure the tent is staked down well and guide it out as necessary. If you're using the optional fly sheet accessory, run the webbing around the intersections where the short poles cross each other and attach the cobra clip to the O-ring on the fly sheet. Pull the fly sheet across the top of the tent and attach the clips in the same way. Tension the corners of the fly sheet evenly. The partial fly sheet accessory improves the tent's performance during heavy rain and snow loading. When taking the tent down, begin by unclipping as many of the cobra clips as you can reach. Make sure you close the gates on the cobra clips to avoid damaging them when you pack them up. Remove the poles from the grommets around the outside of the tent. When removing the poles, do not pull the poles straight out. This will cause the pole sections to separate. Instead, bend the poles to hold the sections together. This will allow you to pull the poles out without separating the sections. If you have any questions about the setup or use of any of our tents, feel free to contact us via our website at www.slingfin.com.